Attend the Lantern Festival. Talk to Lucia in the town center after 7 p.m. Awesome. Saturday, day 28, 6 a.m. So I need a brain jelly still. Let's do a little more fishing. Oh, no, wait. Seeds. Okay, let's go to the store and buy seeds. We can fish up those last fish later. The last Withergate fish. Do I have enough roses for Zaya and Donovan today? I do. Okay, where are they? Donovan is over there. Zaya is in her apartment. Okay. What do you have? Eggplant seeds? Demon seeds? Are those Withergate eggplant seeds? Is that Withergate seeds? It is. Okay, we're going to buy five of all of them then. Five. And see ya. Five. See ya. Okay, so I have five eggplants and five of the demon seeds. We don't need any more of those. I already bought Kraken Kale. Let's buy another five razor stalks. These. Melons. Five of everything. I have one of these in a chest, so buy four. Big plan I bought, demon seeds I bought, withergate fishing rod. Dramatically fancy for a mere fishing rod, demon fisherman, caught using these, anything less to skill to some extent. Withergate by 15 reduces slider speed. Eh, I used the bubble net for fishing. We don't need that. Okay, let's make sure I have everything then. All these we're gonna plant in Sunhaven now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we're not buying Kraken Kale. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, let's go. Let's find Zaya and Donovan and then head back to Sunhaven. So Zaya is here, Donovan is up there. Let's go meet up with Donovan first. I'm saying he's to my left. So this way. Yo, what's happening? Hey everyone, my new best friend Ember is here. Eh, never mind, nobody's even paying attention. <laughs> hey, take this. What is it? It's one of my dog tags. I want you to have it. I'll protect it with my life. Hey, I can do nice thing too. Sometimes. Listen, I can't say why, but that tag is important to me. Don't lose it, okay? You got it, buddy. I got his keepsake. A blue rose. Donovan's dog tag. From now on, I'm only going to march where I feel like marching. If I feel like marching at all. It gives health, movement speed, damage to all attacks, and increased jump height. Huh. Okay. Let's go find Zaya. Zyla. The demon woman. She's still in her apartment. We're gonna go wake her up. Knock, knock, my lady. Huh? Oh, you. What's up? Oh, you again. 
Don't you have anyone else to bother, friends or family? So who do you usually spend time with around here? The king and prince, obviously, then Cordelia, since she's on the royal council with me. You know, I don't spend a lot of time with many other people except you for some reason. Why do I bother with you anyway? Ugh, I'm starting to worry about my sanity. I know you like me, even if you won't admit it. Maybe you're right. She left. She just left. What the heck? Come back. She just left in the middle of her sentence. No, I can't ask her about anything else now. All right, here. It's the least I can do. Okay, so no more talking to them when they're in their apartments. It doesn't, it's bugged out. It doesn't work right. That's the second time that's happened. No more doing that. We'll just wait until we see them around town. Take me to Sun Havoon. Sun Havoon. Okay, the festival is tonight. The years. Don't want to harvest this stuff? Not really. <laughs> no, not today. And then we'll do that another day. Okay, now they're all on the same timer. Good. Chop, chop. Bless the rains up in Sunhaven. Make sure everything got watered here. Sometimes a rain cloud don't be doing its J-O-B. Okay, we're good. What's up, Tiny? Big boy. Big boy. Don't need any of those fish. There's some fish over here. Hold on a minute. What's up, boys? Ah! Okay, let's bless the rains up in Sunhaven. Make sure it actually gets watered. It did. Good. This one should be ready. Nice. Last storm melon. And ooh, we got a golden log on the tree. Okay, these are not ready. How are we doing down here? Everything looks good. No golden fruits. All right, what am I selling? The storm melon, the log, the fish. Fish, fish, fish. That's for the museum. And these are all ready. Chop, chop. Bless the rains up in Sunhaven. Okay. Fish. I need a koi fish. That's ooh, the cuttlefish. That's the last cuttlefish I need for the quest. Nice. Keep getting rich with them boys. I also have enough tickets to donate to the museum now. It needs a thousand for the bundle. All right, selling this and this, selling these fish, star fish. This is quest fish. And then this is Donovan's keepsake. Where was I putting the keepsakes? One of these chests. This one. I need another snappy seed, which I have. 
corn snappy. The cuttlefish, which is for a quest. Okay, we can turn this quest in. 100 melons, we'll sell these 25, or we'll just juice those 25. And then these are going to the museum. That's a quest, these get planted. Okay, then we're gonna juice the melons. Okay, they're done. Wunderbar. Oh, I used all my mana. I can't make more. Oh. So these things. Yeah. Okay, good. Let's put it. Let's see how many spaces they take up. For now, we can just put it like right here. And then let's get to planting. Five of all these things. Okay. So some of these I will need for bundles and then the rest I can save for crafting or like alchemy stuff. I really like this scarecrow. Where do I want to put this? I want to put this somewhere where I can see it regularly. What about right here? Like next to that tree? Yeah, we'll put him right there. These things is ready here. And then turn that quest in. And we can drop stuff off at the museum also. Oh, wait, I need to change these things. We need to change the totems today or the summer pest will come and eat them tomorrow. So let's get the summer ones now. They'll eat your crops on the first day of summer. Okay, we can keep this here as a decoration. And then you're now taking over for this guy. And he can be up here as a decoration. So the spring one can be moved. Summer goes there. This can just stay. We'll put these somewhere else. We'll put the spring totems down here. Okay. And now we're chilling. All right, let's head, let's grab these things. And whoops. So some of these are for the museum and some of them are for quest. This is for a quest. These are for the museum. Let's geek. We need to turn it into Pita. Let's look for Pita. Peter is usually, aha, perfect. Come here, Pita. Hey, hello, Hope. Good afternoon. Shoot, Ember. 
That was quicker than I thought. And look, each one is a perfect catch. Great job out there, rival. No problem, Peter. He gave me a fishing skill tome. Cool. Large fishing nets can now catch fish in two days instead of three. Awesome. So I caved. I got the game. This game? Sunhaven? It's a good game. I'm enjoying it. I do recommend it. If you like Stardew Valley and you like these kind of games. Yes. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. I recommend it. If you like Stardew Valley and these types of games, then Sunhaven is definitely worth playing. It's fun. Okay, drop them in. And I still need a brain jelly, red finned pincer, and an albino squid. This I can catch on the farm. This in the forest. This in the sewers. Okay. We'll go do more fishing later. This is for... Oh, this is for this tank. The big one. All oh, these fish look so nice. All the fish are in here now. Look at the catfish. Okay, and I need an angelfish, which you can catch in the sea. And a koi fish, which I can catch on my farm. Yes, I love Stardew. Yeah, I like Stardew too. It's one of my top five games of all time. Stardew is just... Yeah, it's just amazing. It's very polished relaxed fun game there's a, so much to do and like talking to the characters is interesting there's the whole rivalry between jojo mart and the local uh, store and then there's a community center and the the juni the juni what are they called junimo the junimos and then there's the whole thing with the wizard and he's like having relationships with all the women in town and like he has like four kids in town or something <laughs> that wizard did pretty much anyone with any of the kids with purple hair are the wizard's children the dude gets around loading in the farm Okay, let's put these tokens away. And what are these? These are all elixir farming, combat mining, farming. Okay, we're close to max level with farming. How, what level am I for mining? 59, 70 is the max. Combat 53. Okay, it's gonna be a while before we get combat leveled up. So we may as well just take these. The combat ones. Combat skill tome. Exploration. So I have farming, mining, exploration. What's my exploration? 60? Okay, that's going to hit 70. This is definitely going to hit 70. This one, maybe. We can eat the mining ones also then. Let's do the mining ones. Right, farming will save these. Exploration and farming will definitely hit 70 this playthrough. Okay, two mining ones. Yep. Weak spot. And one more for mining. So this one will let me make more skill tomes for farming and exploration. And the recipes will be cheaper. We'll do this one then. Okay, another one for combat have one skill point for combat. I was doing grit. Increase iframes by 40%. Awesome. Okay, so we need to talk to Lucia at seven o'clock, but until then the day is ours. So let's head back to Withergate and keep looking for those fish we're missing. I need one in the sewer, one on my farm, one in the forest. Take me to the outskirts. Bubble. Mm -hmm. 
Heesh. I also need... I should clear my inventory before the festival. For decorations. Since that stuff doesn't stack. I gotta remember to do that. So I'm looking for a brain jelly. It's brain jelly or bust. I need a brain jelly here and an albino squid I can find on the farm. And then I need a red finned pincer from the forest. Probably won't be able to get all of them in before the festival, but maybe we can get one. If we're lucky, maybe two. A viper fish. Ooh, that looks cool. Eesh. Come on. A Dorado and a Spiked Salmon. Don't need any of these. We're looking for a brain jelly. Dorado vampire squid. <laughs> the squid that wants your blood. 420. <laughs> a mummy trout. Zombie, vampire squid. So we're going to sell all those. Come on, fish. Come on. Hmm. Well, I think I fished out everything in the sewers. There are no more fish in the sewers. Let's re okay, let's reset the map. Refresh, refresh. There we go. Treasure chest. Ooh, had orbs. Oh! We got it. Brain jelly. Awesome. Okay. Take me to the farms. Wintergate apartments. There's like a, a tub here that has withergate fish. Take me to the rooftop farm. This one. So there's an albino squid in here that I need. Oh, look at those crazy things. I think that's a fish. Viper fish. That that's not a fish. That's just a decoration. Devil fin. Ooh, I don't need that though. We need an albino squid. There it is. Oh no, that's a Dorado. Fossil arm. Duo Rado. Dumbo octopus. <laughs> okay. Level up. Fish in here.
let's do the one that has a chance to also give you tokens. Fishing nets now have a 0.1% chance to additionally pull up a community token. So additionally makes me think that you get the fish and tokens 0.1% of the time. I'm fine with that. You like thingy. I need albino squid. There's one right there. Fish. Fish, fish, get him. Dead eye shrimp. Don't need any of these. We're just gonna we're gonna sell all these fish. It's almost time for the festival. We'll leave at seven o'clock. And I need to dump all my stuff in a chest. A Kraken. Looks like a fish right there. It is. Get him, boy. Sick him. Another shrimp. Another octopus. Okay, one more fish. Thought I saw something down here. One more, one more. Come on. Looks like the pool is out. Okay, there it goes. Last one. That's not what we're looking for. A sea bat. All right, let's go. We're going back to the sewers and then back to Sunhaven. Come aboard. Sunhaven. Hee. Okay, let's drop off these things in a chest to make room for stuff to buy at the festival. Yard drop off. We'll hold on to the spring tokens in case there's something to buy with that there. There was stuff at the winter festival that needed winter tokens and I didn't have them. Okay, so we're going to town center. Wonderful. You are just in time to join me on my way to the festival. Are you ready to go now? Let's go. Welcome everyone. I'm honored to have you all gathered with me tonight. We are here to usher in the new season with a fire in our hearts, represented by the candles that will carry our wishes aloft in the sublime evening air. I can smell summer blowing in on a wind on the wind already. Have I mentioned that this is my absolute favorite event of the year? The beautiful lanterns, the promise of a bountiful season going forward. It fills me with hope. Now that you've all been so patient, let this year's lantern festival begin. Bernard, you may take it away. Yes, mm -hmm. hello everyone. To prepare for the upcoming summer, it is crucial that we follow tradition. When everyone is ready, we will release our wish lanterns at the same time. Most importantly, everyone must hold a true wish 
in their heart before releasing the lanterns. This will imbue the lantern with energy for our guardian Elios, of course. If the wind is favorable and the wishes are true, then we will have a prosperous summer indeed. And of course, thank you all for being here. Now let's have some fun. Okay. Well, let's talk to people. Let's start over here. Rosa, I hope you're enjoying the festival. If anyone starts acting up, don't hesitate to find me. Salone. I'm not one for making wishes, but I'm also not one for breaking tradition. So here we are. My wifey. The Lantern Festival is my absolute favorite night of the year. Can you believe it's already here? Time seems to slip by so quickly. My girlfriend. Lucia told me we each get a wish tonight, but I don't really believe in that stuff. Do you? Donovan. <laughs> He's playing with the kids. <laughs> Help. I snuck into this party and these little minions are chasing my tail. Topi. Come back, puppy. <laughs> Let's talk to Pod. Can't talk. We got to catch this dog. Mom's going to be so happy when you bring this home. Another one of my girlfriends. Lynn. You know something? This festival is not far off a holiday we celebrate in the eastern region except our lanterns sail away on boats instead of flying into the air june and van the lantern festival is a nice break from the norm people seem to cheer up around this time of year what a lovely night to have a celebration you look great in this light ember van is such a huge flirt <laughs> he's always flirting Van, he wants some. He wants some of this. He wants some of the fire of his. He wants to warm himself by Ember's fire. You look like you have, you're have having fun, darling. She called me darling? I'm her darling? Ronald. Nothing rings in the new season like a nice bowl of noodles. Okay, what are you selling? Festive oranges. I've already eaten a hundred of those. Spicy ramen. Sure. Pork ramen. Huge amount of mana. Egg ramen. Moon cake. Chow mein doesn't provide any permanent stat increases. Rice ball. Nope. Dumplings. No. Oh, you don't get to buy new festive orange trees. I bought them last season and that's it. You only get two for your playthrough. You're not allowed to get any more than that. It's sold out again. Okay, Bernard. Oh, wonderful, Ember, you're here. I must make sure everyone present is ready before we begin the main event. Because the festival will end after the main event is finished. Are you ready to start the main event now? We will begin a lantern just... You will be given a lantern just before we begin. Not to spoil the surprise, but you're something of an honored guest tonight. What are you selling? A large, a lantern festival selling portal. I'll buy it. A box paper lantern. Looks like he has an unlimited number of these. I'll buy five. An hourglass. I'll buy five. Tapered. I'll buy five. Paper lantern strands. These look like decorations. Like house decorations. I'll buy five. Oh my god, they take up all your inventory space. Okay, well, I'm glad I dropped off. They don't stack. I'm glad I dropped off stuff then. Uh, okay. And then, oh, this portal has a dragon. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, we'll put that up somewhere. And, all right, let's keep talking to people. Giuseppe. Careful with the festival food. It's easy to overeat when it tastes so good. His wife, Tanya. 
I know exactly what I'm wishing for. Don't ruin it. Ember, I'm glad you made it. I can't wait to send my wish soaring into the universe. This reminds me of summer nights in the Southern Islands. The days were too hot, so everybody came out at night to socialize. At least I get to see the festival. He's selling a rabbit plush. I'll buy it. A year of the horse plush. I don't know if I'm going to have room for all these things. Let's make sure I have room. I have room for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Teen. 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I have room for 24 things. Okay, we can buy all these things. Now the trick is going to be where to put this stuff. <laughs> There's so many. Where are we going to put all this stuff? We'll figure it out. That's a, a problem to figure out later. We're buying one of all of them, though. Okay, how much space do I have now? 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 slots. Uh, okay, let's keep talking to people. There's the diamonds. Xyla. Human celebrations are so weird. Why do you need a whole... Why do you need to have a whole event just to throw a party? This would be a regular night in Wintergate. Darius? Is this what humans consider a celebration? Celebrations in Withergate are far more grand than whatever this sad little display is. But I suppose you have to work with what you got. Zen. Say, are you the farmer of this town? Then come here. I've traveled across the world with a special pet. Okay, I bought his pet last year. Let's see if he's selling another one. He is. Don't want to buy this one also. Sure. We can put it in Withergate. I put the other one in Novari. We'll drop this one off in Withergate. Claude. These little festivals are cute, but I don't get the excitement. All you do is light a candle in a paper bag, right? Nathaniel. I wish all my soldiers could be here. They deserve a night off. Then again, who knows what mischief they're getting into in my absence. Steven. Oh, Steven. That's the guy that I fought in the forest. And then I gave him a second chance and let him move into Sunhaven. He's here now at the festival. I've never been part of such a warm community like this. I don't know what to wish for because I feel like I already have everything I need from this town. You're one of us now, Steve on. Catherine, one of my girlfriends, two of my girlfriends. <laughs> I love big events like these. With everyone gathered to celebrate, it reminds me of holidays growing up. Kite. I haven't tried the food yet, but it smells amazing. Elizabeth. Do these wishes really come true? Really, really? Emma. What are you going to wish for? Wait, never mind. Don't jinx it. Liam. Oh, hi, Ember. I baked some popovers for the event, but I forgot them. I hope Emma and Elizabeth won't be too upset. Mm, okay. There's Pete over here. Can't seem to talk to him. But other than that, I think that's everything. We visited all the shops. I bought all the plushies. He sold out a plush. No more plushes. <laughs> I bought his pet. I bought all the food from here. Oh, over here. I almost missed Iris. It's off over here on her own. I've never been to a festival like this before. I've already had three bowls of noodles. Noodles and that's that's it then all right let's start the festival let's do it fantastic everyone attention please i trust everyone has had plenty of time to enjoy themselves thus far at this time i would like to lead the event toward its finale the wishing 
We release these wishes not only with the hopes that they will come true, but also so their energy may combine with that of our guardian, Elios the Sun Dragon. As the lanterns float past dragons meet, Elios will take in their wish energy and transform it into an immense blessing for Sunhaven. If we have enough wishes, we could be looking at an easy summer ahead of us. This year, I want one person in particular to make the first wish. They have proven themselves to be a singularly caring member of our community. Their selfless work has already pushed Sunhaven in the direction of progress. Ember, of course, I'm talking about you. You deserve to have the first wish, after which the rest of us will follow. Please release your wish lantern. I wish for more women to join the harem. <laughs> now everyone together. Send your wishes to the sky. The wish. We still have Xyla and Iris to add to the harem. There's the dragon. Thank you, everyone. What a lovely sight. I already feel quite optimistic. Now, everyone should feel free to return home and dream of the splendid summer that awaits. I'll see you all next season. Quest complete. I get a reward. A chicken lantern, a chicken lantern, a rooster lantern, a silly chicken lantern. I took this one last year what's this one silly chicken lantern let's take a rooster and we will find some place for it later it's oh my god it's 11 o'clock we don't really get i gotta go we don't got much time we don't get much time for this okay let's equip my tools at least and then put all this stuff in here this goes in these spaces up here. Bloop, bloop, bloop. We will sort this out later. How much time? Ooh, not enough time. Okay, we'll sort out the rest of the inventory tomorrow. It's bedtime. Good night.